We go Hey my loves, welcome back to another video. So this video is going to be me answering a question that I got um, on my BMT experience video. Um, I believe this question came from Julissa St. Flair. Um, so she was basically asking about hairstyles and like the different hairstyles I did during BMT, how I maintained it. So I figured why not turn it into a video because I know probably other people have the same question as well. So pretty much during BMT, um, I could kind of only, I could speak for females and like more so African American females since that's what I am. Um, but for me, I did, you see these braids I have in my hair? That's exactly what I did. Um, I basically did knotless box braids um, and it lasted me throughout the whole BMT, um, which I'm grateful for because I feel like, especially with like my type of hair, like our type of hair, like curly hair is a lot to maintain. And during BMT, you really don't have time. <laughs> like you have but so many minutes to shower. I mean, I guess on Sundays you can technically wash your hair if you really wanted to, but like I still feel like that's not enough time. Cause like you gotta take your time. Like with our curls, you gotta take your time and you gotta, you know, finger stroke it and all that. You gotta give it some love. And during BMT, you can't really give it the proper care and love that it needs. So I would say a protective styling, exhibit A braids, um, is something that will help. Um, other girls that were there had like um, cornrows, either cornrow their own hair or cornrows with extensions. Um, girls of other ethnicities, um, basically a lot of them had, they just pulled their hair back into a bun. Um, sometimes they would ask other girls to like braid their hair for them, especially during Beast Week. Um, Beast Week is a lot, so pretty much everyone had their hair braided then. Um, um, braided down like plaits and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so I feel like for me, for us like African-American girls or mixed girls, um, I feel like the best thing for y'all to do is pretty much to get your hair braided. Um, you, could, you can bring a weave if you want, but like that's like more maintenance. You want something that's like low maintenance and you not really have to do anything with it. Um, so yeah, I feel like braids is the best way to go. There's not, to recap, there's not really that much time to like give your hair really some love and care. Um, for me, how I maintained my braids was pretty much, I wrote a headscarf and a bonnet. Yes, they let you keep that um, at basic. So don't let no one tell you different. They let you keep it because it's something to protect your hair. So yeah, they will let you keep that. Um, I also bought like hair oil so I bought um I think I bought peppermint oil with me and then I bought like this hair grease from I think it was Carol's daughter but it was like the travel size one and I was just like um this word moisturize I moisturized my scalp and like the braiding hair and stuff like that um but yeah just keep it moisturized and I guess as clean as you can because it is gonna get dirty but like my braids lasted me the whole I was as y'all heard in the other video, if y'all did not watch that video, I highly recommend that you watch it because it's very informative. Um, I'll probably link it on the screen somewhere up here, but it'll definitely be in the comment, not the comments, oh my gosh, the description box down below. So if y'all want to go check that out, y'all can go check that out. But yeah, um, I forgot what I was saying before, but yes, keep your hair moisturized and it should be good. Um, these braids, well, the other braids that were just like these, they lasted me all throughout um, basic training, that's what I was saying. They lasted me throughout basic training. My basic was only five and a half weeks, but I know other girls who have, like, had the longer basic training and they had braids as well. Um, and it lasted them the whole entire time. Cause I took mine out once I got to um, my tech school, probably a couple days into tech school or so. Or me being at my tech school, probably not, not starting tech school yet, but being at my tech school, I took my braids out and like just washed my hair because I that's the time I actually had the time to like give my hair the love and care that it needs, you know? But yeah, so overall, like I said again to recap, protective styling, protective styling, protective styling. My most recommended for y'all is braids either box braids or cornrows but i would say box braids um not less it's just a lot cuter in my opinion 
um, and it's easier for you to put in a bun as well because you do need to have it within um, a certain size or they will make you take it out. Um, so with mine is like they um, spaced it like bigger so bigger spacing so bigger sections and then it's it thins out at the end so that way you're able to wrap it up in a bun um i'm actually at drill now for um the air force so i'm here in my hotel filming um i probably should have just filmed my drill weekend but i didn't do that so if y'all want to see that let me know down in the comments below because i did do one before but it was when i was in student flight and not in the actual like air force air force you know so let me know down in the comments below if you guys want me to do that and if you guys have any other questions about the military or about anything else i do a lot um nursing um acting modeling singing life just leave it down in the comments below and i'll get back to you guys all right but all right guys love you bye Love